Good day everyone. Welcome to this basic cardiac telemetry series. In this post, we will talk about sinoatrial block and sinus arrest. Look at these three strips. What is your interpretation? Sinoatrial block, also called SA block or sinoatrial exit block, results when there is an abnormality in the conduction from the SA node to the surrounding atrium. As with AB block, SA block is characterized as 1st, 2nd, and 3rd degree, with 2nd degree block subclassified as type 1 and type 2. 1st degree SA block represents an increased time for the SA node's impulse to reach and depolarize the rest of the atrium to form a P wave. It cannot be seen on the surface EKG because the impulse generation in the SA node do not produce a deflection. Second degree SA block can be seen on the surface EKG. It could either be type 1 or type 2. Third degree SA block occurs when none of the sinus impulse fail to depolarize the atrium. This will appear as junctional rhythm with no P wave. SA block type 1. In SA block type 1, there is progressive increase in the interval for each SA nodal impulse to depolarize the atrium and create a P wave until an SA nodal impulse do not depolarize the atrium at all. On the surface EKG, there is gradual shortening of the PP interval with an eventual dropped PQRST complex. There is group beating or may manifest as regular sinus rhythm with pauses. In this strip, there is group beating and shortening of the PP interval until there is a drop PQRST. There is no evidence of PAC or premature atrial complex on all the leads that can explain the sudden bradycardia. Sinoatrial block type 2. In sinoatrial block type 2, there is a drop PQRST complex with a PP interval surrounding the pause that is 2 to 4 times the length of the baseline PP interval. This is because there is a consistent interval between the SA node impulse and the depolarization of the atrium until the SA nodal impulse is not conducted. In this strip, there is complete absence of the expected PQRST. The surrounding pause is equal to two times the baseline PP interval. Sinus pause or arrest versus sinoatrial block. Sinus pause refers to brief failure, while sinus arrest refers to prolonged failure of the SA node. There is no universally accepted definition to differentiate the two. This is due to the failure of the SA node to generate an impulse. On the surface EKG, it is seen as an absence of PQRST complex. To differentiate it from SA block is to measure the PP interval. During sinus pause, the PP interval is not a multiple of the baseline PP interval, while SA block is a multiple of the baseline PP interval particularly SA block type 2. So in this strip, this is sinus bradycardia around 57 beats per minute with a bundle branch block. The pause is not equal to the baseline PP interval, making sinoatrial block type 2 unlikely. So what is the interpretation? A is sinoatrial block type 1. B is is sinoatrial block type 2 and C is sinus arrest. Thank you and have a good day everyone.